With the emergence of cloud services and cloud adoption by enterprises, Wi-Fi has definitely evolved from a commodity to a utility, imposing itself as a new communication channel. The partnership between Cloudify and Extreme Networks allows customers to benefit from a compliant, secure and personalised guest Wi-Fi captive portal that provides access to digital services. Cloudify offers compliance with all existing regulations and data privacy. Enterprises and hotspots also benefit from value-added captive portal features with marketing tools and exclusive third-party services to extend the customer's digital strategy from the web to Wi-Fi and to transform the Wi-Fi into a powerful communication channel to interact with their audience. In addition, the solution provides unmatched user experience with personalised Wi-Fi offers. Extreme Networks allows you to apply the same configuration to several devices via the network policy. Although this limits security, it is possible to connect Wi-Fi terminals to a router or a firewall, which would improve security. System management and guest registration are granted using Extreme Networks' technology and only need a few steps to be set up. First of all, we'll need to get the Cloudify required URL, company hash and radio secret. The first one is available on your Cloudify administration interface. Go to the Locations menu and select Copy Splash Page URI. You'll need to perform some changes on this link. The second one is in Settings, Company Account, where you copy the Cloudify public key. Cloudify provides the radio server information, either by using the chatbot interface or by email, so don't hesitate to ask us. When a user logs in, an authentication request is made to the Cloudify Radius server, which registers and authenticates the user. So let's set one up. On your Extreme Cloud IQ interface, go to Configure, Common Objects, Authentication, External Radius Servers, and create a new one. It requires a few entries, a name, let's say radius.cloudify.net, the IP, and the secret provided by Cloudify. a Wi-Fi SSID to which the users connect using an external captive portal with the Cloudify splash page is needed. Go to Network Policies and add a new standard wireless network. Provide a name, let's say Guest Cloudify, and select Open as the SSID authentication. Then you need to enable Captive Web Portal and check User Auth on Captive Web Portal and disable UPA. We are using an external URL for the authentication, so let's set up a new captive web portal. Provide the Cloudify splash URI. Disable the UAM password encryption. After the authentication, you can redirect the user to a specific URL. In the advanced settings, we need to enable the HTTP 302 redirection and configure the walled garden, allowing the user to access the Cloudify captive portal. Next, we select the Radius server to authenticate the guests. We also define the user access settings by selecting the user profile logged. If you have several user profiles in your network, it's a good idea to isolate them by applying a different user profile to each profile using Radius attributes. Extreme Networks allows you to send the syslog data to Cloudify. This data is pseudonymized to comply with privacy regulations. The network policy can be deployed on various access points. The real-time access logs visible in Extreme Cloud IQ are pseudonymized and accessible through the visitors menu of the Cloudify interface we allow the link to be made between the token and the visitor's real identity. I hope that you found this video helpful. Please feel free to contact us if you have any further questions.